What's up guys, today I'm coming at you with a comparison video between the Nike Authentic jersey and the Swingman jersey. I'm going to be going over all the details and uh, which one I think is better for the price. The Authentic is $200 and the Swingman is $110. So let's take a look at both of them. Shout out to Soul Gazer. I made this video inspired by his Warriors comparison. I'll put a link in the description below so you can check that out on his channel. First, we'll take a look at the collar. They're pretty similar, but there are some differences on how they're woven. The armholes use the same design. The Authentic's armholes are larger than the Swingman's. And the material on the Swingman is a ribnet hem, while the Authentic uses a finer weave. Next, we'll check out the side panels. The side panel on the Authentic has a slit at the bottom, while the Swingman doesn't. The Swingman uses a consistent mesh pattern throughout the whole jersey, while the Authentic has different sized mesh holes over the entire jersey, going from small to large. The Authentic is also two inches longer, but both jerseys do feature Nike Connect. These jerseys are both size 40. The Authentic features a team slogan, while the Swingman doesn't. Next, looking at the Nike Swoosh. The Nike Swoosh on the Swingman is a thin patch and you can actually see the mesh underneath while the patch on the authentic is a thick rubber material next we'll look at the word marks the authentic has a stitched on twill word mark it's a gray twill with a white border stitched over the top the swingman is a heat pressed patch it's one layer and looks very flat. And the numbers are a similar deal with the number on the authentic um, having a perforation and also uh, double stitched in the case of this authentic, though the game uh, jerseys are different, I believe. Next, looking at the back. The authentic uh, armholes do not go all the way around while the Swingman does. The NBA logo is very similar to the front Nike patch. It's very thin while the authentic has a thick rubber patch. The authentic also has that championship patch stitched on. My authentic's name and number is set a lot lower than my Swingman's. So it sits farther down my back. Next, I'll show you a close-up of that perforation on the number. So, I, I do think that the Authentic is a better deal. It has a better fit. And at $200, it's not too bad of a price, considering Adidas charged $300 for their Authentics. The Swingman is a good product, but... For just $90 more, I think you get um, a lot of quality out of the Authentic, and it is something that the players wear, so that feels pretty good. So thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe. I'll be going to the home opener on the 17th. It's only about uh, six days away now, so I'm super excited for that. Stay tuned. Go Kings!